My name is Swan Phai Nongrum and this is my story to tell. The inspiration for you and I Arts Cafe is based on my childhood memories where I want it to be a youth centric space where they can reconnect back to their childhood memories through food, music and games that we offer to the customers. We have a direct link with the farmers, you know, because this cafe serves uh, more than 140 teas and there are five traditional teas which we get from the plants, uh, especially the jajo, which is called rusela tea. Then we have elephant's apple, then we have uh, chakrat, which is milak ferox, and also we have a lemon, uh, lemongrass tea. And to get this uh, agriculture produce we directly link with the farmers so that the farmers can get extra income so this cafe so far are able to help more than 13 families who are belong to the farmers community the cafe is so different because we engage dropout youths who are unemployed and we generate employment to 15 unemployed dropout youths the UNI Arts Cafe runs on a sustainable model based on trust. What I have created the space for the cafe crew is that they can make their own decision uh, where they feel the sense of ownership. Uh, they come up with new ideas like for example day before yesterday you know they, they have uh, raised a concern there are no foods that really suit the children. So you know if I don't give them the space to be the, to own the, the space then I will direct them you should do this for these children, you know, to serve these children. But instead, I ask them to come up with new ideas and try it out. If it doesn't work, then you try, you know, I you come up with different options so that you can give to children and see whether it works or not. If it works, then you carry on with that. And you keep experiment, uh, we, actually we keep experimenting with stuff here uh, in terms of food uh, serving to people. As you enter the, ca uh, the cafe in the, uh, in the uh, in the outdoor. Once you enter on the right side, you will find a traditional Khasi kitchen, which uh, in Khasi we call Gadpei or Saudang Kaliung Gadpei, as we say, we sit around the fire and we share stories. And this is also nowadays with all the modern uh, houses with new design and uh, architecture. Uh, it's very difficult to explain to the young ones about how the Khasi used to cook the food. So to remind them about all the childhood memories once again. So this uh, fireplace where we cook food there and the food that cook there we serve to the customers here. is one way to connect people with the roots that they come from. So most visitors who come to the cafe thought that I promote Khasi culture. Actually, I'm not promoting Khasi culture. I'm making people feel culture by having traditional food, traditional music, traditional games. And here you'll see on your right side, there's a, a Khasi alphabet, A, B, C, D in English, but in Khasi we have A, B, K, D. Most of us seem to forget because of the modern technology. We are busy with mobile. We forget our roots. So that's why this cafe is uh, based on as I mentioned you earlier about the childhood memories, so eating uh, red potato together as a family, eating food together as a family, and in the eating you are able to share your stories and you can uh, tell your knowledge to the young ones. So this is the space where you know we revive back the oral tradition of the Khasi tribe. My message to them is you know you be good to uh, to yourself, trust yourself first and then trust others but if you don't trust yourself you cannot trust others so i insist to them that they trust themselves first and be good to all the customers in the way they talk and the way they engage with them because the visitors who come then they will judge you from that uh, you know the outlook but they will not really see the inside of you but what we do here actually we help the each and every member of the cafe crew to we do things about you know going deeper into their uh, understanding level not from this outside thing but the inside i believe people who come to coffee they'll go back home they reflect they reflect back oh what a space it is